Howdy. Welcome. We're here at the Blodgett Canyon Overlook Trail, something like that. Uh, I've actually been here. This is my third time here. Uh, came here three or four years ago with Alyssa. Um, and got the car stuck at the parking lot and never hiked at all. Came here yesterday with Alyssa. Um, Alyssa didn't have the right foot gear, so we only went a little bit up the trail. Um, now I'm here again today, actually trying to complete this little hike. It's very short, less than one and a half miles to the top, uh, but we'll see what there is to see. It is a lovely, like 55 degrees or so. A lot of snow on the trail, but it's all getting really slushy and melty. So, whoop. we'll see what there is to see. We are immediately treated to just these views, looking up the mountains there and down the valley a little bit towards the cliffs and that peak. First peak down into the canyon, I think. Actually, the canyon might be over that ridge. I think it probably is. made it to the top of the overlook here. Let's have a little bit of a look around. Here's the best view up here, down into the Bitterroot Valley. Hamilton's over there behind the trees, but you can see northeast. Forgot to uh, put my contacts in, so I can't wear sunglasses, which is a bummer, because the snow very bright in the sunshine. Here's our look into the Blodgett Canyon. I'm just doing a little bit of off-trail snowshoeing now, seeing what there is to see. There's no particular goal in mind. Uh, just seeing if I can get a little higher. Uh, this time of the year when there's snow all over the ground, uh, it's not really problematic environmentally to go off-trail because you're just on snow. So it doesn't matter. It can be problematic navigationally. Easier to get lost when there's no trail. but. Snowshoe tracks are pretty easy to follow back. 
so I'm not too worried. Remember what I said about following snowshoe tracks back and it being really easy? Well, it is, but I'm not doing that. I decided I was never too far from uh, you know the actual end of the trail, the overlook, it's right over there. Um, the whole time I was never more than like 300 yards away from it probably. So I figured I know where I'm going and I know where the trail is, so I'll just take a different way down. And it's been quite lovely, just exploring, following all the rabbit tracks, trying not to fall in tree wells. It's a good time. Just like that, back on the trail. We'll see how long I can avoid taking the snowshoes off. <laughs> 